Hello, my name is Minhal Chatu and I'm a consultant knee surgeon working at One Hatfield Hospital. So a knee osteotomy is a surgical procedure which involves cutting either the shin bone or the thigh bone so a leg can be realigned, taking pressure off the arthritic area, uh, relieving pain. The beauty of osteotomy is patients do not have anything artificial in their knee joint that, that, that can fail and therefore they are allowed to do whatever they want to do, whether this is any form of exercise, running, sports, climbing mountains, whatever they want to do, they're allowed to do. So in the past, uh, osteotomy was reserved for uh, young patients uh, who were felt to be way too young for a joint replacement. But we now know that osteotomy can be suitable for all age groups. And in fact, the oldest patient I've carried out a tibial osteotomy on uh, was 75 who managed to return to the golf course within six weeks uh, and he was very happy that he'd avoided uh, a joint replacement. And so the decision uh, regarding suitability for an osteotomy is not so much based on chronological age, it's based more on physiological age, what the desired activity level is and also whether patients are suitable once you've done the planning. Most patients after a single bone osteotomy will go home the next day. Uh, they don't require a brace or a plaster uh, and they are allowed to move their knee straight away. However, they do have to uh, use crutches for a period of time. And most patients after a tibial osteotomy will be able to walk into clinic at six weeks. Hello, my name's Nicole. I'm a physio at One Hatfield Hospital. What I do here is work alongside Mr Chatu, um, helping him with his osteotomy patients. So I attended a specialist training course over two days with Mr Chatu. The knowledge that I gained from it has helped me with all my rehab patients and I've also conducted specific training for all the staff that we work with as well. Once patients have had their knee osteotomy surgery with Mr Chatu, they then get referred to physio for rehab exercises. We work on specifics, we work on their individual goals, so if they want to be kneeling and um, playing with their children on the floor, or if they want to be going back to running half marathons or anything like that, then we focus all their rehab on doing exactly what they want to do. So the first thing is making sure they've got all their range of movement, making sure they've got their strength, and then working on running, jumping, hopping, skipping, or anything else that they want to do after that. With a knee osteotomy, they have a lot of uh, more benefits compared to having a knee replacement. So if you've had a knee replacement, there's very limited knee range of movement that you can get. So you can only bend your knee a certain amount um, and you get a lot more stiffness. The rehab takes a little bit longer and you're technically not allowed to run after having a knee replacement. So with an osteotomy, all the knee joint itself isn't actually affected. So the bending should go back to full range and be equal or better than the other side. Um, and then you can actually run and jump and hop on that leg because the knee joint itself hasn't been affected by surgery. 